What's going on Lego Maniacs? Welcome to our third, um, or my third haul video ever. Um, but also we're throwing in a give giveaway. Just got 100 subs and uh, yeah, we're celebrating it. So it's gonna be kind of interesting. Uh, I got four sets here. You can choose um, which one you want if you win. Uh, how to enter in, you have to be subscribed. And then um, yeah, leave a comment, uh, whatever you wanna say. Uh, it can be a question, it can be the set that you want, whatever. And if you put more than uh, one comment, it's not gonna increase your chances. Um, you, you know, that's not fair. But yeah, just uh, make sure you're subscribed and leave a comment, you'll be entered in. But the choices that I got is the first one is the Imperial Patrol Battle Pack. So you can win that. Or the uh, Tatooine Battle Pack. It's also a good set. Uh, I'm also throwing in the Bounty Hunter Speeder Bike Battle Pack. So you can choose that one as well. And last but not least, um, you can win the, uh, well it's the set 40292. It's kind of like a holiday set, basically a present, but in the back, or it opens up and it's a little home. Uh, but yeah, so look, that's, uh, that, those are the choices. Um, yeah, and again, just leave a comment, make sure you're subscribed and you can enter and win that. Also, I thought I'd mention, um, we're gonna be giving doing the giveaway video next week. It might come in in a haul video, uh, believe it or not, there's another haul. Um, or, but I'm buying too much Lego to spend all my money. Uh, but anyways, it might be coming in a haul video, or it might just be a one-off video. Uh, we'll see, but I'll definitely um, be, be looking at this next week. I'm gonna choose a winner. But now, let's get right into the haul. So, we got the first package of the uh, another haul. I didn't think I would be buying any more Lego again this quick but there's just so many good deals I could pass them up I'll show you guys what's inside as you can see it's a very big box it's probably like three feet tall and we've got Acto Island there's tons of stuff in here <laughs> uh, another one if you're looking for a set for resale this is fantastic this I know a lot of people hate it, but I got a good deal on it. I'll get into that at the end of the video. Um, Duel on Naboo. Another good set. Uh, that's a good set for resale too, if you're looking for it. Got a couple of these um, Patrol Trooper Battle Packs. Uh, and the uh, Jawa uh, Tatooine Battle Pack, which is also really good for resale. I got another one of them. Uh, I got this set, uh, Cloud Rider Swoop Bikes. I actually am excited about this set. I think it's actually pretty cool. It's a pretty unique Star Wars set. And then I got the uh, new Anakin's Jedi Starfighter. Um, we really good to do a comparison on the old and the new. And another Duel on Naboo. And... Another Jawa, and last but certainly not least, we got the new Jedi Starfighter with Hyperdrive. I actually have the Episode 3 version of this and the Episode 2 version of this exact Starfighter, obviously without the Hyperdrive ring. But yeah, that's this haul, and uh, yeah, there's quite a bit in it, but there it is. So, we got another package for the haul. This is also off, uh, off of uh, Amazon Prime. And we got three of these. It's the uh, Yoda's Hut. If you guys are looking for a set to invest in, this is an awesome set. Um, you'll be able to make some money off of this uh, when it retires. Uh, but yeah, anyways, that's what's in this box. So I got another package. Open it up, see what's inside. So, oh yeah, I got two more of these. Um, Duel on Abu, really good deal off of uh, Amazon Prime. Uh, but yeah, that's this small haul. So we got the final package of the haul. I'm starting to actually use a tripod for this, uh, just because that way it's a little bit more um, level. <laughs> uh, but yeah, if I can get it open. And this is the last package of the haul. 
And that is... Yoda's Jedi Starfighter. It's a pretty good looking set. I don't know why they stuck it in the stupid bubble, bubble wrap, just because it can get wrecked that way. But yeah, that's the last of the uh, haul. Now let's get into it. So, now that we got through all the packages, um, I got them all laid out here. Uh, there's quite a few to go over. Um, you're going to find out where uh, to get good deals. I know I do that every so well. I've been doing that every haul video. Just because, I mean, if you can find a good deal on LEGO, why not? So to start off, um, this is probably my best buy, maybe out of the entire lot. And that is the Jedi Starfighter with Hyperdrive. I paid 80 Canadian, which works out to about 60 US. So great deal, and I got it from Toys R Us. And then, the uh, second set that I got, I got two of these actually. It's the Acto Island set. So I also got it from Toys R Us. Um, it was 27 U, uh, Canadian, which works up to about 20 US. So good deal. And then the uh, I got the um, Duel on Naboo. So I bought two of these from Toys R Us. Um, it was going for 23 uh, Canadian, which works up to about 17 US. So not a great deal, but not a bad deal. Um, I might be building a Duel on Naboo mock, we'll see. Uh, how to get Hoth first, fin uh, finish first, but that's on the agenda. And then I got the Cloud Rider uh, Swoop Bike. Um, I wasn't really, I didn't know if I really wanted this set, but honestly, it's a great set. Um, I think it looks really unique with the different speeders. Uh, and anyways, we'll see what it's like. I'll do a re review on it as well, but uh, excited to get into that set. And then I got the most debatable set of the lot, and that is... General Grievous' Combat Speeder. Look at how tiny um, this thing is. I just wanted to point out, we'll get into the price for this. This is Anakin's Jedi Starfighter, which we'll get into later. But they're the same size, and one's over twice as thick. Uh, this set also has 100 more pieces, so this set's an absolute ripoff. Um, although I paid um, 27 Canadian for it, which works out to about 20 uh, US. So it wasn't a bad deal, at least it was $8 off, and I really was really wanting the General Grievous, uh, especially for Mox, um, he's going to come in handy. Anyways, it's not a bad set, it just should be worth a lot less, um, but a lot of different LEGO YouTubers will tell you that. Uh, the next set I got was the Tatooine Battle Pack, um, and it was okay deal, I got them for $13 Canadian, which works out to about $10 US, so not a bad deal. And then I got the Imperial Troop Battle Pack. This also was a great deal. Um, they'd only let me buy, I think, up to a maximum of three. I only got two, which I, is probably a mistake. But uh, I paid 10 Canadian, which works up to $7.50 US. So, pretty good deal. Um, and then, Anakin's Jedi Starfighter. Uh, this set I paid only $19 Canadian for, which works up to 14 US. So, pretty good deal. Um, and I'm actually anxious to get into that, do that comparison, like I mentioned. And uh, yeah, then that brings us to Amazon Prime. Uh, Prime is honestly amazing. Um, I got these Duel and Naboo sets for, I got two of them. And I paid 20 Canadian for it, which works out to 15 US. So that's a better deal than Toys R Us. Um, even though Toys R Us wasn't a bad deal. So I got two of them from there. And uh, then I got Yoda's Hut. I bought three of these. Uh, they're going on for 25 uh, Canadian, which works out to 19 US, so pretty good deal. And then the last set I got was Yoda's Jedi Starfighter, paid 24 Canadian, which works out to 18 US. Uh, another thing is I got Rex, this is the end of the haul, 21 bucks, so that kind of sucked, but I'm really happy to finally get them. I'll be able to include them in a review. I thought I'd throw that in, I got them off of Bricklink. A lot of these sets, you might be wondering, why did I buy multiples of? Um, if I bought multiples of them, I think they're a good set to invest. Uh, just off, off the top of my head, Acto Island, um, Dulan Naboo, definitely Yoda's Hut. Uh, those sets are great for investment as long, along with any of the battle packs. Um, they're fantastic. Uh, wait a couple years and you can double, triple your money. I've done it a number of times. Uh, but yeah, that was my haul video. Uh, again, with the uh, giveaway. Uh, make sure that you uh, leave a comment, make sure you're subscribed, you get entered into that. Don't worry about the shipping or anything, I'm going to pay for that, obviously. 
Uh, but yeah, that's all I got for you in this episode. Thanks again for watching. If you liked the video, leave it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, definitely consider subscribing. Uh, but yeah, that's all I got. Take care. Catch you on the next one.